What's up guys, Johnny here, welcome back to Turbo Dismount. Now I know it's been pretty recent since I did my last episode, it was about a week or so ago, but anyway, they updated the game this time, they didn't, the, the game wasn't updated when I um, played it last time, but they updated the game this time, this is probably the last time we see Turbo Dismount for another month or in a couple months or so, it is the muscle update, and we have a new vehicle, let's check it out. So this is a new vehicle, it is a muscle car, it's called the Bandit, and we're going to see the pose that uh, Mr. Dismount has on it. Oh, that pose looks like he's ready. Look at that sexy arse right there. Okay, um, this pose, okay, that's another one right there, and okay, that's it. So we're going to go with this one, as uh, you can clearly see what's in front of us. Let's get right to it. Believe me, Jack, heart of a warrior. Um, that's the heart of a baby. Eye of the tiger, Bob, eye, eye of the tiger. That's not the eye of the tiger. All he needs is a little bit of encouragement. All you need is a little bit of encouragement. He died because I said encouragement wrong. Can we ramp off of the part of the snowplow? No, we can't. Jesus. Oh, this is the perfect vehicle for this level. Keep her going! Holy sh... I think a Bob needs just, like, he needs a little bit of a, a, the chain. So we're gonna change him into Mr. Stalwart. Mr. Stalwart, and we're going to do the new vehicle on him. Let's see what poses he has on there. So we're going to go with this pose right here, and we're not going to know what's going to happen because we're going to look for a side. See, everything's fine. Up, uh, scratch that. Everything's going to be fine. That's why we paid you this for free. That's why you accepted this job for free. No, we will not be paying for your medical bills. I have the warrior. Be brave. Does that look like being brave? Well, I can understand why you somehow can't be brave when a snowplow is speeding after you at like 70 miles an hour and you're going the same matter. Basically, you're playing just a chicken with a snowplow, so yeah, I can understand why. One last time! I think that should be your last time. I, I won't punish you anymore. This level is called Super Fun Boom Times. I guess that's why. Jesus! Well, Bob, I may have underestimated the power of this level. I don't think you even know what's coming, do you? Jesus, Murphy, holy sh... Ah! There we go. What if I made it so that I, like, I ramped onto the mine? What if I did so that I, I ramped onto the mine? Let's try that. Can you ramp over, like, onto the mine? Can you land on the mine? Oh, he barely got it with his head! Yes, that's what I wanted. Alright, that level's getting a little boring. Uh, let's go to a new one. God, what do we pick? What do we... Now, since I have a better PC now, uh, and a better graphics card, I'll be able to play the levels that I've usually never been able to play before. So, let's give that a shot. We got manual steering for this, so, Bob, I want you to just slightly turn into the left lane. There's no cars coming, you're fine. Um, I'm sorry, but I that doesn't really look fine. Look at him, he's fine. He is absolutely fine. Just go automatically to the left. There you go. Oh, oh, and now you're heading to the right, and you're fine. You're absolutely fine. Never mind. Why did you decide to slide into all that chaos? Alright, when I let the level sit, that does make my computer get laggy, so uh, I'm gonna try something else. We're just having a casual stroll, safely here, just casual stroll, on my butt. Now, why did you fall off? What are you doing? No! My bike... Oh, it landed fine. I'm gonna go slow for this so I don't fall off of this uh, this bike here. I'm just gonna go slow. Make sure Bob can make his turns. Go down the hill safely. And most importantly, not do that. There you go. Keep your control. Keep control. And... Oh! <laughs> there we go, man. That's what I like to see. Now, that was a good job. I'm gonna give that an A-. minus. Now, why did I just grade someone over how much they just got annihilated by traffic? All right, we're gonna try a different route. We're gonna try a different route. Can we make it? Um, all right, so we're gonna have to make it to that back wall over there. Okay, so let's do some adjusting. All right, let's put a turbo pad there. See how that helps things out. Oh, I think we did it. I think we got it. We got it. We were just short. We got full speed now, boys. We are doing this full speed now he got shorter than last time we changed a couple things Let's see if that will help and it looks like it will not even full speed ahead please hit that turbo pad and hit that one and yet we still we still made we still were short how are we short 
I think we added another ramp for not a good reason at all, because it just failed. Right, let's not go as fast, and then we'll hit the ramp. Let's not go as fast. Oh, that may have done it. That may have done it. That may have done it. No, we're short! Dang it, dude. All right, let's go. Come on, please. Just hit the ramp. Hit the ramp. And yeah, it's, store. it's, it's still not... It, it, I, don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. How do I go from full speed? I, I don't get it. This is a long journey down the stairs. That's the thing. That's why no one likes this path. You were literally just short. Look how close that is. Look how close it is. If you can make it down the stairs and get to that... I mean, seriously. Oh, you got it. Never mind. Look how, clo look how close. Look how close it is. Look at that. That's disappointment. Better not be a failure. Don't be a failure. Oh, you're not a failure. You are a failure. You overshot it. Why is getting the speed right so freaking difficult, apparently? Yeah, apparently getting the speed right is just the most difficult thing in the world. I just want to get hit once. Please! Once! You just missed it! Will that do it? Please. Will that do it? Will that do it? I think it will. It will! Thank the Lord. That took forever. Jesus Christ. Well, um, when you see what's going on in this level, you'll understand why it's called the Blender. I just want you to look down at this. Yeah, th this is what's happening in this level. Th this is what's happening. This is why this level is called the Blender. Look at this. Oh my god. There's no bits of him left. There's no bits of him left. And then we end up in a freaking puddle of mines down here. Can we even make it down? We, we can't. Okay, there we go. And... We are ending up outside of this, outside of the cup. Running up outside of the pitcher. My score was 25 million, and I reset. I'm a freaking idiot. God, Mr. Stallworth's pecs are so big that it interviews with the first person view. Jesus. All right, here we go. Yay! What's this? Ooh, this is a like a freaking roller coaster. All right, here we go. That's not a roller coaster. I can tell immediately that this is not a roller coaster. Look at him. He's just happily falling down. I don't think he's happily falling down. He's just wondering. Oh my god! It literally just hit him like a baseball bat and just knocked his head clean off. Jesus, man. Oh, hit the edge. And we're gonna land in the cup. Yeah, we're gonna land in the cup. Yeah, we landed. I may have a test for this level. I may have a test. Just let me get it set up. Now, do you think that the blender can withstand the power of a bulldozer? Let's find out. You, sir, are the majestic beast we love today. Well, you fell out, but, um, the majestic, uh, beast is, doesn't look, oh, there it goes. Yep, look at that. Just sliding on past them, sliding on past, Jesus, I'm not sliding on past them. Bulldozer is, and we land outside the pitcher. So, yeah. It's only April. Why is the seasonal mode a skeleton? Now, I don't really think that this game has the power, the windmills have the power to destroy a majestic beast like this. And if Bob stays in the vehicle, if Bob stays in, he's perfectly fine. He's perfectly fine if he stays in. Look at this. Look at this. He is perfectly... Oh, no. he's gonna... Yep, he fell out. Uh-oh. I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. I don't know why this happened. I, I called... You should have called a lawyer. You should have called a lawyer. You should have, like, you should have... Well, gladly you have insurance. What? This game is so weird that it's messing up how I speak English. Full speed ahead, Bobby. You have to go in a corkscrew. We're going in a corkscrew. Will he fall off the track? Will he fall off the track? Let's find out. Oh, he's getting close to the edge. He's getting close to the edge. He's getting close to the edge. Oh my god. Dude, here we go. Here we go. The grand finale! Not really moving that fast, but let's get it some time. Let's try this in a first-person view on the Shuriken. First-person view on the Shuriken. Uh-oh, he's gonna fall off. Uh-oh, 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 oh god, oh god, and he's gone. Um, something hit Bob in midair, and I have no idea what it was. I wasn't recording it, but something, like, completely hit him in midair. Or he hit something while he was flying. Yeah, apparently Bob hit a billboard that was on there. He hit, like, this billboard or something. He hit a billboard. All right, let's not go as fast with the shuriken, and yet it still looks like he's going to do the exact same thing. It still looks like he's going to fall off. Oh, he's getting closer to the edge. There we go. He's getting closer to the middle. All right, we're golden. Bob's view has just been freaking... Oh, severe road rash. 
and he's gone. I'm going to do this entire thing on the freaking skateboarder. I'm going to do this entire thing. The entire thing. All right, and we're off. Let's see how long he can last. Hopefully the time limit won't run out, because if it does, that will be a huge pain in the butt. So it looks like he's staying in the middle so far. He's already shaking his head like, no, this is a this is not a good idea. Or he's just beating his uh, head to the, his head to the uh, beat of the music. Oh, 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 he's getting closer to the edge. Now he's getting closer to the edge. His speed isn't really picking up, uh, which, uh, great. Keep her going. Just keep her going. Just keep her going and everything will be all right. But in this case, everything just went absolutely wrong. All you have to do, get past the train. And that doesn't really look like getting past the train, if you ask me. Keep calm, keep your composure, and okay, get past the train, that's good. Now, um... I have no idea what just happened. Be the majestic beast that everyone knows you for. Just keep her going and live life to the fullest. Well, sorry, you can't really do that anymore. And last, but certainly not least, this was the time when Bob decided that I'm actually going to win. So you know what he did? He got past everything. Thank you very much. Good night. Well, guys, that'll do it for this episode of Turbo Dismount. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more Turbo Dismount and when they update the game in the future. By the way, this game, uh, if you don't know, it's been out for a pretty long time now. It's free to play on Steam. If you haven't gotten it already, I recommend that you get it because it is a very fun game. Just don't play it too often or else it will get boring and you'll delete the game. So play it like every once a month or something like that. But anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new. I'll talk to you all later. Thanks for watching. What I'm wondering is if Bob can somehow make it past. I didn't really answer my question. Can Bob make it past the train? Well, great. Thanks for answering my question. Well, he can certainly make it on the bike, right? Nope, he can't. Uh, thanks for watching.